the way. In this edition of Just Fix It, handyman Dale Cranston shows you how to free up your hands. Working around the house, doing a little painting, I thought, hey, there's got to be a better way to take this door off the hinges and do the painting than just laying it down flat or leaning it up against a wall. So being both a carpenter and a painter, I thought, maybe if I could just put some legs on this door, it'd be a better way and we could work with the whole door all at once. So let me show you what I'm talking about. Take out this last pin on this door. We have our door free. And, you know, we take off the hinges and the handle, but for sake of, of, of example, let me show you what I mean by legs. What I thought was, if we could just have this door stand up just like this to paint it and to deal with it, sand it, whatever we needed to do, that would be the ideal situation. So what I came up with was simply cut a couple of two by fours, and the painters that I talked to are simply amazed when they see this idea. Take a couple of two by fours, drill some holes in it, or turn our door on its side, and we're gonna use these drywall screws, you know. They'll change your life, drywall screws. That's what good living is made up of. A good set of three-inch drywall screws and your little drill driver here. Let's see if I can get this, screw this right on the bottom. We're gonna use the three-inch screws so that we make sure it's, it's gonna hold up real well. And rather than using nails, this way we can back them right off when we're finished with the job. Put another one down here. Now we've got them both secured on the bottom. We can simply stand it right up. And it's nice and sturdy. We could fill this whole room with doors, maybe spray them or brush them out, but it gives us opportunity to patch and fill and sand or do anything that we want to do. Peel off these old green piece tags, things like that. Really gives us an opportunity to work our craft on this door on both sides at once so we don't have to wait for dry time while it's leaning on a table or leaning up against a wall. Keep that in mind as you handy people are working and painting around the house and working on your doors because I think it's a real nice way to speed up your process. If you got any questions or tips, you can get a hold of us at the World Wide Web at doityourselfer.com. We appreciate you staying tuned and getting these tips to help clean up Detroit. For the Newsbeat Saturday, I'm Dale Cranston. Good right. tips.